Hi all, welcome to the new episode of Tech Insert. We are going to make a model of solar panel sun tracking system. The one we are making is a working model which is pretty good for science projects. If you want to make a bigger system, replace the transistors we used in this model with power transistors. 2N3055 and MJE2955 are examples of transistors which can be used for powering geared motors which has the capability of carrying 50 kg per centimeter. This is a single axis sun tracking system. In the future I will be making a dual axis sun tracking system. So please stay tuned to my channel. The complete schematic diagram is given at the end of this video. The circuit is wired around an edge bridge which is commonly used for rotating motor clockwise and counterclockwise. Here in this edge bridge we have used a feedback from one rail and the other one is controlled by two LDRs. The circuit is so simple that it contains four transistors, four resistors and two LDRs. The motor we have used is a geared motor, typically 5 RPM or 10 RPM will do its job perfectly. We should use a geared motor, otherwise the solar panels could not follow the sunlight because of the high speed operation. I have tested this circuit with a 12 volt 50 watt panel and it's working perfectly fine. The panel I am using in this video is 6 volt 160 milliampere, which is a small one. I have used the same geared motor for 50 watt panel. I have tried to make the assembling so simple so that anyone can assemble this. Please do not skip this video and do not forget to like and share this video.
There are so many types we can fix the solar panel in the motor assembly. The one I have used is a fixed shaft model. Normally the motor's shaft will be rotating but here the shaft will be fixed and the body of the motor or stator will be moving. Even though our system has the capability of moving 360 degree but in reality only 180 degree movement will be there that is sunrise to sun sunset. The exactly same one can be used for science fair project. While I am testing with a 50 watt panel, I used the BD139 and BD140 transistors and the solar panel is fixed on top of a plywood and the motor is fixed at the center of the rectangular plywood. If you believe that this video is helpful then please click like button and also share this to your friends. If you have any suggestions or doubt related to this circuit or anything then please comment on this video. Please subscribe to my channel for getting more videos like this. That will be an encouragement to me for making more things like this to you. This is Tech Insert signing off. See you in another video. Till then goodbye and please take care.